How's it going, guys? Are you guys ready for some more spooks? 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 Yeah? That's good, man. That's real good. Well, here's the park. So, for 13 days of... Ooh, scary. There's gonna be another gameplay of a psychological horror game. I think it's a... Um, a spin-off of The Secret World. So... For any of you, the Secret World fans out there that want to, that likes that kind of environment, I guess this is the game for you. So, let's head into this. Cue the intro. Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. Shrieking skulls will shock your soul and seal your doom tonight. The park is a narrative experience best played in a dark room wearing headphones. That's what I'm doing right now. That's that's great. During the course of play, the park may manipulate objects, audio, control settings, and your sanity. Oh god. Another psychological horror game, guys. If you guys haven't checked out the forest or forest gameplay, my god. I, I don't even know if that was a psychological horror game, but I know for a fact the the painting was one layers of fear in my heart God. and mind I always return to Atlantic Island Park Where's Mr. Aww. Bear? I haven't seen Mr. Bear Callum Mr. Bear don't love you anymore, Callum. He doesn't love you. But holy Stay crap. Stay in the car. We'll go and ask information. Right off the bat, though, this game is beautiful. You're beautiful! Can, can we go third person mode? Callum, your bear doesn't love you. He doesn't love you anymore. It looks beautiful, guys. This game looks nice. I'm guessing there's no run button. Attention yet. patrons, the park is now closed. Please make your way to the car park at your earliest convenience. Please what? Prepare the park for shutdown. Why is it shutting down? Why, why are we even here then? Press A to interact with objects. Examine Placky. Mom was born the day this place opened. This is his favorite place in the world. So if this is his favorite place in the world, why are we going here at the when it's closing? Huh? Huh? Ooh. What? Ooh. That aura, though. I like her outfit. Hey, Lorraine. It looks adorable. Lorraine. Don't blame yourself, Lorraine. People lose things all the time. Take a deep breath. Think about the last place you saw your son's teddy bear. Hey, stop! Oh shit! I think your boy just ran into the park. That ass though. I'll unlock the gates for you. That ass though. Holy crap! Her body. Bodies was well, one land, one land, bitch. Give me my teddy bear. I want my teddy bear. Teddy bear doesn't love you anymore, bruh. Audible and visual cues. Wait up guys. there for mommy, Callum. Oh, whoa, that is cool. That is cool. Callum, where are you going? <laughs> this way. Do you guys see that? <laughs> Whoa, that's like. Welcome to Atlantic Island Park. When I first came to visit Solomon Island, I fell deep, deeply in love with its natural beauty. Places to sleep, overlooked motel for the big ones, for the teens, the lobster trap. I know I'm reading this like all over the place, but. If you guys want to keep reading this whole thing, just just pause the video. Don't worry, we won't judge you. And we'll if you guys pause the video, welcome back. That's ooh, there he is. That is scary. Callum, where are you Callum. going? Callum. There's something special about the entrance to an amusement park. A line drawn between the real world and the world of whimsy within. On this side, the apathy of our everyday lives. And on the other, anything we might dare to dream. 
It's no wonder Callum ran back inside. I wouldn't want to leave either. Attention employees, the park is now closed. Is that Have shit blood? Is that shit blood? Why is that blood? What? What? What's going on? Oh, hell no. Nah. Oh, hell no. Nah. Oh, my God. Oh, we're at the park. Okay, we're at the park at night. This is how long this fucking elevator is. We stayed there for so long. It's already nighttime. Stop! Kill him! Oh, God. The park. What happened oh. here? So we can run, and it's toggle running. This is beautiful. This is great. Be Hello? Oh God, that is dark as fuck. Wait for mommy. Bitch. Bitch, where the fuck? Oh my God, why is the, why is the, why is the park like that? Why would I have? If I was a kid, oh, hell no, fuck that shit. But right now, I want to go in there. Can I go in there? Carry Killian is Satan's... Ooh. Whoa. 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 Offensive little ass fucking poster board. Wow. That's offensive. That's fucked up. That's fucked up, bruh. No, stop shaming. Stop it. I'm no Satan's whore. I'm just a messenger. And Satan told you this. Fuck. Fuck you. Ooh, examine shoe. I think this belongs to Calm. I can see the lower half of my body. Look, look. Do you guys see this? The lower half of my body. This is a great game. This is a great game. Uh, uh, oh, oh, oh. It's Alvin. Hi, Alvin. Chad the chipmunk, huh? Chad. Just a oh my guy God. in a suit. Chad the chipmunk, worst in class. Chad can't even seem to pass. Chad gets angry, likes to fight. Chad is beaten every night. Chad will have a dead end job. Chad will die, a useless slob. Oof. Huh. Huh. What the fuck? I need to pee. Pee. Pee pee. Nope. Nope. I can't. I can't pee pee. Read I hand. I wonder what this is. Purchase the land or Solomon Island for a pittance. Pittance. I might add whatever old Archie Henderson did to the old locals. Someone's whispering. Oh god, that is creepy. My lawyers had arranged everything in advance, but the. Realtor still had to come and deliver the keys to me personally. He took it upon himself to offer me another warning. I don't know what you're planning to do with this island, Mr. Winter, but the soil here is bitter with a curse carried from the old country. And man, Henderson, he did terrible. Dark things the land remembers, sir. I dismissed him shortly afterwards, mostly amused by apathetic by pathetic attempts at warning me off. I have a great vision for this place and the will to see that vision through to the very end. This is the start of something amazing. Oh god. What have you done? I'm guessing this park has like built on some Native American land. Oh god. Is this what happened to Disneyland? Is this the real Disneyland. Blam, blam, blam. Calum, well, it's not. Stay where you are. It's technically not really Disneyland. It's more like mm, Universal Studios, somewhere like that. Yeah. Can we ride oh, these boats? The fuck? Where? Are, the fuck you at? Is that you? No, it's not. That's. Do I ride these things? Can I ride these things? No, I can't. That's cool. That's great. Who we who we don't appreciate fucking darkness. 
Hello, darkness, my old... Shit. Callum, I'll beat you up once you get here. Where the fuck you at? Come out, sweetie. Oh, there. Come on this way. Why is Another this so accident? This place. What the fuck? Open. Oh shit! Fuck you, teddy bear. Why? If you guys want to read that, just pause pause the video. But despite the constant interruptions to work, Atlantic Island Park will be opening on time. The governor booked to cut the ribbon. So the only real question is whether we will have any customers. I'm not truly worried. The customers will come out of simple curiosity. I deduce that that was needed from bad writings from Archie Henderson. Oh damn that that bear has a fucking Oh whoa that is that bear has a knife on its eye How how do you how do you mess up so bad that you seem to crash this thing this van and get a knife in your eye That's amazing Callum where did you go Over here Over here Kind of, I swear. And I Where are you? Over here. Callum. Callum, if I could jump these rocks, I'm gonna fuck you up. Ooh. Ooh. This is like senior night. But a lot more scarier. And everything looks like it wants to kill you. That's that's great. That's great. I love things that kill. This old thing used to make the blood run to my head. <laughs> make me dizzy. The guy just snapped. Those poor kids. We were waiting for our turn on the ride. Frank me and the boys. This fellow in the chipmunk suit is making a nice carving while people took photographs. Lawrence wanted to go over to him but I've always been a bit wary of those suits. They give me the creeps. It's silly I know. Anyway the chipmunk man he was carving and picking away at the ice and at first we thought he was making some animal like a tiger or a lion but as more and more ice fell away when you first looked it was like a human face smiling out of that block of ice. But the more you looked at it, the more you saw that there was something not quite right about the proportions. Something unnatural that made your heart begin to beat just a little bit faster. Like you were prey, and that thing in the ice was a hunter. Whoa. And then these teenagers walked up, and one of them made a face at the carving and said something rude to the guy in the chipmunk suit. And then, well, he went berserk. For a few moments, it was chaos. Everybody was running away from the guy who had, one, who had one of the teenagers on the ground and he was stab, stab, stabbing with the ice. Oh, shit. Damn, chipmunk. Holy crap. Crap, crap. Oh, God. It's a killer chipmunk. Killer chipmunk on the loose. <laughs> <laughs> Callum, come back here right now. Come on, mommy. What? What? What are you calling Wait me? For mommy. Over here. Over where? Don't hide from me, Callum. This way. Okay. Okay. Where are you really taking me, Callum? Do you want to ride this thing? Cause I don't. I'm scared. I'm scared. Look at that fucking chipmunk. Nope. I wanna. I wanna ride it. I can't Hell. get on while it's moving. Oh. Okay. 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 I'm gonna. I'm gonna get on. How that? Decrease speed. 
Slow the fuck down. Slow the fuck down. Down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. Something that better pop out because there's a fucking window right behind me. Alright. Stop. Oh, is is he on the right? Or is it or is it just me? Callum! Catch me, mommy. Is it him in the right? No, it's not. But I'ma ride this shit. Screw you, Callum. I'ma have some fun. Oh, I did not notice that head. Look at me. I'm like a bird. Fly. Fly like a bird. That is one creepy ass head. Oh my god. Is it going faster? It's going hella fast. I like this ride. I like it. Ooh. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is this? Oh, that is... What the hell was that? Oh, that gave me goosebumps. Oh, oh, oh. Chills. Chills. This part got no chill. Okay. Whoa. There he is. Uh, hello? Holy crap. Callum? Over here. You know what, Callum? Callum, stay where you are. Come on, this way. Where? On, sweetie. Over here. I swear, Callum. If you're gonna take me the Where wrong way, go? I'm gonna. This way, mommy. Okay, okay. So Stop, I'm following Callum. the voice. Come on, mommy. Come to mommy, Callum. Over here. Where are you? Come on, this way. What? Didn't we like just pass this are area? You? Over here. Okay. Callum. Tell mommy where you are. This way, mommy. Okay. I'm coming, Callum. Stop! Okay. Callum! This way. Okay. I'm coming. If only I can see you, though. Wait, Callum! Catch me, mommy. Bitch! You won't even show yourself. Oh, I Callum, guess we can ride it now? Are you? Oh, there he is. I see you. I see you. It's either that or it's a... Uh, it's a freaking... Callum? Hello? Oh, there it is. There it is. We have to go to the swan. Next ride! I'ma love this. I'ma love it. Ride swan. It's so romantic. It's a small world after all. It's a small world after all. It's a small world Okay. So you know that that ride that I was just singing? Like the one in Disneyland? You know how you go under a tunnel thing too? God damn, it's so Near much. Near a great forest, there lived a poor woodcutter, his wife and his two children. A boy named Hansel and a girl named Gretel. They were very poor and had very little to bite or sup. What will become of us? The woodcutter asked his wife one night. 
I tell you what, husband, we will take the children into the thickest part of the forest tomorrow what? and abandon them there. No, my wife, I cannot do that, said the man. Then we will all four starve, you fool. Hansel and Gretel overheard their parents talking, and Gretel began to weep. Do not fret, Gretel, Hansel said. He crept out of the hut and gathered white stones from the ground to fill his pockets. 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 I like this ride, though. This is a pretty the cool ride. The next morning, the woodcutter leads the children into the forest. Before they leave, their mother gives them a slice of bread and warns them that they will get no more food that day. Clever Hansel leaves a trail oh. of white stones behind them as they oh. pass into the woods. Hi, Chipmunk. When their father leaves them, the children wait a while. Hi. The trail I'm gonna just watch this shit. House. No. After receiving a thorough scolding from their parents for getting lost in the woods, the children are sent to bed without any supper. Hansel tried to sneak out and collect more white stones, but found that the door was locked. Tomorrow I will take them into the woods myself, the wife told the woodcutter. Hmm. In the morning, their mother gave them a slice of bread and led them deep into the forest once again. She's trained them into, to become Spartans, man. Hansel broke his bread into pieces and left a trail of breadcrumbs to, bread be done. to lead them safely home. What am I looking at? But hungry-eyed birds snatched up the breadcrumbs and his trail was destroyed. Ah, Damn bird. Abandoned by their parents and unable to find the trail home, the children wandered in the forest for three days. The children stumbled into a clearing with an exceedingly strange house. Its walls were made of gingerbread, and its windows were panes of clear sugar. Hansel, desperately hungry, ran forward and began to nibble on the walls. You, you go, Hansel. You go. That's what I would do too. I'd eat that house up. Nibble, nibble, little mouse. And the witch too. My house. An old woman emerged from the house, sniffing the air and peering around with cloudy eyes. Oh, you dear children, who brought you here? Just come in and stay with me. No harm will come to you. But Hansel and Gretel stayed back, for the old woman reminded them of their cruel mother. Come, children, don't be afraid. I have something for you. Yeah, that's fucked up. The old woman offered them two enormous lollipops. Lollipops, the children that's took it. them and began to eat. You see, nothing to fear here. Come inside, the old woman urged, and the children, still licking their sweets, followed. Don't take candies from strangers, guys. No candy. Oh shit! I'm Once sorry. The house, the old woman what was that? She what? Is that like a, a signal of me getting freaked out? And put Gretel to work, sweeping and cleaning uh, her you hut. You Your brother will make a good mouthful, the old witch told Gretel. Once he is fattened up, I shall feast upon him. Oh. Well, yeah, we, we all know the story of Hansel and Gretel. If you guys haven't seen... Time wait, passed, uh, and poor Hansel refused to eat, fearing the day that the witch would eat him. The witch, for her part, grew impatient. Today, I will cook and eat your brother, Gretel. <laughs> Climb inside and light the oven. We just gonna bake your brother and we'll go... Not I'll be good. Understand. Uh, I do not know how. Where is the opening? Fool! The old witch said. The opening is here! Wrecked! And she moved to show Gretel. 
Seizing her courage, brave Gretel gave the witch a shove, and the old crone tumbled forward Wrecked. into the oven. Gretel slid a large iron bolt over the door to the oven. Gretel freed her brother Hansel, and together they lit a fire beneath the oven. And though she screamed and begged, the children sat by the oven until her screams had stilled, and the witch was cooked. That's so dark. I don't know why it's a, like a children's story, but holy crap. And then, because even children oh. can't survive on sweets, they divided up the body of the old witch and ate her. Oh. Oh. What a great story. What a great story. I, I'm pretty sh I'll make sure to tell my kids that. That story. That is not vegan though, so I'm pretty sure. Oh, hello. Hi. You want to kiss? You, you want to kiss? Oh, okay. Okay. That's that's cool. That's cool. That's fine, duck or swan or little shit. You don't want to kiss? That's cool. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. Kind of hurt. I'm hurt, duck. What? Why? Why didn't you? Why didn't you kiss me? But that was a nice ride, though. That was, that was somewhat peaceful, except for that chipmunk. Fuck that chipmunk. Nope. 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 There's my boy. Hansel and Gretel. I used to read it to Callum when the electricity was shut off. Those poor children. The whole world against them. The forest. The birds. The old witch. Even their own parents. I used to imagine that Callum and I were the kids in that story. Not mother and son, but brother and sister. Hand in hand against the unkind world. We were always hungry. Looking for our own house made of candy. Looking for the sweetness that could take the pain away. Hunger leads people to desperate, terrible places where the tree branches reach like claws. Mommy needs to see you, Callum! Oh, hell no! You better not be whispering, Callum! Come back, Callum! Why are you whispering? I can't even hear you! not playing anymore, Callum! Yeah. <laughs> Bitch. Mommy needs to at? see you, Callum. 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 Ulam. 